Maybe we ski the beast after lunch. I don't think I'm... it'll be that challenging. It'll be fine. This last summer, the avalanche scene from Force Majeure kind of yeah. went viral on Twitter. Yeah. A lot yes. of people thought it was real. Yep. Yes. I wondered if you were clued into that and how it made you feel about, you know, you're in the midst of editing this movie at the time. Yes. I, well, even I saw at that point, but then even after when our trailer came out, people still were commenting on the trailer, oh my God, they made a movie about that viral <laughs> video of that guy who ran away. <laughs> so having known Force Majeure and to see it without the subtitles mm -hmm. clearly removed, you know, for the thing, it was pretty funny. Having this American family be in the Alps, you get this fish out of water element to it. Yes, right. exactly. What, what was so compelling about that? Why, why did that feel like an angle to take for this? I've always felt like, you know, Force Majeure, which uh, loved, and there is a quality to it that feels like a little play inside there, mm -hmm. which, it, you know, as far as like an inciting incident causes these two hearts to have to sort of figure out whether they can go on from here. So I think there's, there's a lot of wiggle room there to explore different characters within that realm. Mm -hmm. Obviously, this is taking Americas, like you said, fish out of water. And it all, but without losing the cringe and the awkwardness and all the things that make Force Majeure so juicy. And, <laughs> and we've always been attracted to the balance of comedy and drama and mm -hmm. comedy that's sort of a gift or reward from that drama. So that's sort of why I think we were drawn to it. Plus, I guess Jul Julia and Will are interesting to work with. And everyone wanted to go to Austria. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, yeah, Austria. Yeah. That was really what I was going to say. But, that was yeah, gonna, but I, I was all those other reasons, too. Yeah, <laughs> yeah well, sure. <laughs> and schnitzel. That's I Schnitzel and skiing. Every day is all we have! How could I run away in ski boots? What? Can you run in ski boots? Not very well. Boom. Exactly. Regardless, I wouldn't leave my family to die. That's boom. Are there similarities between Billy and Peter and the two of you? Yes. 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 <laughs> yes. yes. Pete's to my right. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm sorry. No. See, I'm that's too sorry. Late. It's too I'm late. I'm sorry you're feeling that way. See, that's his apology. Oh, A non-apology, right? <laughs> so what happened during production that we need to so talk about? So many things. Yeah. Every, oh, what happened so since we met things. 99? Just, yeah. we, let's just start there. <laughs> It's, it's like so a, you guys have met in like 20 years ago and you've been working together kind of since then? Yeah, we, yes. we met at the Groundlings in, here in Los Angeles, you know, mm -hmm. improv theater, and we were doing bits and sketches forever. And then I think we were just sort of like any actors, like, let's write something for ourselves. And uh, that mm -hmm. sort of began this journey. Huh. I think we found sensibility with, you know, roughly sensibility that matches The up. same. <laughs> the same. Mm -mm. I wanted to ask about Christopher Hibshu because, of course, he's kind of the connecting thread between the two. Yeah. What did it take to get him on board this time around? He's so funny. He was so, so game. He yeah. was so perfect for that role. Uh, you know, and Searchlight also, to their credit, like loved the idea of it. And it sort of, not only was he perfect, but it was sort of a nod to the original. Mm -hmm. And it was fun that he kind of... And in a role that was not in the original, so it just right. felt like he could make it again his own this particular thing is on. Yeah, yeah. Which and he did. is such a wonderful spirit. Like, he was just game. There was a warning. What? Posted at lifts, gondolas, hotel receptions, restaurants, shops, bars, soda machines, toilets. We didn't see any of that. Well, 